All right, so question is, any thoughts on DAG, D-A-G, which is Constellation? Okay, uh, so so let's have Bill pull up that from the, from the TA side. Then let me take a look here and see if we can pull this up from uh, our from our readings. Now I know because we have looked at this in the past before. DAG hasn't really scored well f from uh, a long term value investor perspective, right? So uh, honestly, I don't really think there's too much to to talk about in in terms of DAG. Now obviously that's we, we kind of have our own way of rating cryptocurrencies, right? But uh, I mean, even from a from a trading perspective, I mean, uh, is there is there any upside at the moment? That does it look bullish to you, Bill? Okay, coming right up here it is. Okay, so th this is Constellation versus Bitcoin. All right, now this is a big theme throughout crypto, right? It's this idea of the downward sloping wedge, okay? In other words, bears are trying to hold something down. Now, in this particular case, all right, we see bulls make this huge charge up at this top line, right? And it looks like the sellers are there to meet them, okay? So A, it's gonna take a while before we would know, um, but this um, this doesn't feel like a breakout is imminent because a lot of times when it breaks out, it just kind of goes. So it's wait and see, but the bulls maybe have had their day, okay? And you're going to have to wait four or five days to see. Now, that said, uh, if this thing turned around and made a new high, especially since you know how to make money in alts in this market, right? If it goes up 15%, buy it because it's going to trip, right? So <laughs> don't, don't do it right now because the bears are pushing back. Okay. That said, if it becomes the next Kava, then you know how to trade it because that's been the deal in this market. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Bill.